Happy day, YouTube. I am, I would be out there if I could. <laughs> I need the sun. I need it. Oh my gosh, I need it so bad. I'm still sick. But it's getting better. It's getting better. It is. I even took an emergency packet yesterday. <laughs> So I just left the gym and it just like, it blows my mind. Like, why are people so afraid to sweat? They are just, they're mortified to sweat. It's, it blows my mind. I was actually, I was thrilled because it was actually, it was so warm in there. Normally it's freezing cold and breaking a sweat is pretty much impossible but it was so warm in there. It's like you just walk in and you start sweating. And I was thrilled. I was absolutely thrilled. I was so happy. I was like, yeah, I can get a workout in and actually sweat. And, and, and as I was leaving or getting ready to leave, there was this woman on her phone like, it is just unbearably hot in here. <laughs> She's like, I'm leaving. I can't take it. How can people work out in this? And and I'm just kind of giggling to myself. It's a gym, lady. You're supposed to sweat. But it, you know, it does occur to me that most people, you know, they don't, they don't drink their water. They don't. Uh -uh. They don't drink their water, and they're eating processed foods, way too much sodium, and and really heavy stuff, meat and cheese, and and. And, and so, yeah, that it makes sense why they can't handle sweating, you know, it's just, I mean, you start your day with a green juice, a bunch of water, a smoothie, you know, or <laughs> you can handle sweating. And I, in fact, it feels good to sweat. And I just kind of, I'm like, I need to sweat, detox, detox, because <laughs> I'm sick. Of course, I'm not, I'm trying not to overdo it, but... I am trying to soak up some vitamin D here. Don't be one of those people that's afraid to sweat. Just make sure you hydrate. It's as simple as that, you know? But I'm trying really hard to live in the moment. I'm one of those people that's like always... 10 steps ahead of myself and, a, and when I'm sick it's a I'm thinking of it as a very good opportunity to to live in the moment in this moment I want to soak up some sun yes and so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna soak up some sun and, and stretch before I get on with the rest of my day uh, this other thing that's been on my mind lately, it's um, thought is to the mind as emotion is to the body. And I've been like really observing how my emotional responses affect my body. So when I get irritated and by something someone says or frustrated or sad and just noticing trying not to judge it because when you judge it, it it can make it worse but just trying to observe how our emotional responses to things affect our body our physical body in me I've really noticed that It really affects me. It really, my emotional responses really affect my physical body, especially my stomach. It's like I, I hold my emotions in my gut. It's, it's weird. And how liberating it is when I can actually live in the moment and observe those emotions as opposed to allowing them to overcome me how much less pain I'm in it's it's 
it's kind of unreal. It doesn't ever go away, but it, it definitely helps. So just my thoughts this morning. It is morning to me. So good morning. I hope that you have a beautiful day, night, morning, afternoon, whatever time it is. And you soak up some sun. Om Namah Shivaya.